Do me a favor, say that again. She ain't fast, but she'll pull like a Peterbilt. <laughs> so today, I'm gonna be fishing with a coworker of mine who is also a subscriber of mine. Brian, say hi to everybody. How's it going? And do me a favor and tell the viewers, what are we gonna be doing today? Uh, we're gonna go hit the Huron River for a few, see if we can catch some fat smallies, and then who knows where else we'll go, try a couple lakes around here. Are we gonna catch fish today? Oh, we're gonna catch some fatties. More importantly, are we gonna have fun? Oh, we're gonna have tons of fun. All right, here we go. First spot, right? First spot. Okay. Okay. Which way are we going here? All right. <clears throat> now, by the way, you guys, I know a lot of you know that I don't really trespass when I fish, but today we're going to be going to his spots. I really don't know where that's going to take us, so hopefully it'll go good. Dude, I've never, I've never been here. It's shallow, but it's still a Gotcha. Oh, dude, it's real. It's real shallow. What'd you get one? Oh, he's hooked up already. What the heck? A smallie on the crankbait. What? Hold on a second. Wait, wait, wait. First fish of the day. And it is a smallmouth. Look at that. Little guy. Yes. It's still fun to pet, baby. Yes. Wow, dude, that did not take long at all. All right, so what we're going to do is we're going to get out of here and we're going to go to a different spot. He got the first fish of the day, which was a small, smallmouth. And I hope that. That is a good indication of what today is going to bring. So we'll see you guys at the next spot. All right, dude. You've caught the only fish of the day. I haven't caught anything. We've fished for maybe an hour. And I feel like it's not going great so far. We're going to catch fish, I'm telling you. Guaranteed. Oh, dude, well, now, now I know why you want to come down here. Hold on a second. <laughs> yeah. this, this right here is the culvert I was talking about. Yeah. Usually the water's up right here, and we're standing back here fishing. And this used to rush out of here, and this used to be a huge, deep bowl. It's all backfilled because the current stopped. Gotcha. The water level's been going down over the years. Yeah. And, I mean, dude, it's just, I mean, Are you, you got to fish between the weeds. There's weeds, see him poking up? Yeah, are you starting over here down there? I'm gonna stand on this side. If you wanna stand on this side, fish. Now this is a huge sandbar. Goes out, it goes all the way to the, across the river. That dark spot right there, it's Yeah. Like a culvert. Okay. It's kind of like an underwater river stream. Gotcha. Runs through there, it's, and it's a sandbar because all of it backfills on itself because it's just a slow current. But this, this in the winter time, this whole lake will freeze besides this one section. This will be the last thing to freeze because it's moving water gotcha but, okay um, yeah we're gonna catch him <laughs> okay here we go no i didn't dude, that thing jumped out of the water 
Dude, jump out, huge pike, dude. Huge pike. Mm. See, that thing jumped out of the water for my spinner bait. Not too bad. He got it. A little, pike. <sighs> a little pike came out of, kind of came out of nowhere. <laughs> pike on the spinner bait. And away he goes. Sweet. No, yeah. He's a little worn out, but he's going. <laughs> what? Oh, it's a fatty, dude. Oh, yeah, dude. Not too bad. No, dude, that's a nice one. Oh yeah, dude. And the white spinner bait. That's a nice one. Let's see if we can get this hook out by hurting him. Oh yeah. Oh bass too. Oh yeah. He's got a bass as I'm changing over. What'd you catch it on? He's got a bass on the spinner bait. Hold on a second. That scar. Oh yeah. Little one. Oh, little scar. Excuse me. Yeah. All right, dude. Come on, microphone. Cooperate. Switched it up to a Strike King Red Eye Shed. This perch color. Oh, right there! Out of nowhere, get up here. There we go. That almost startled me. Because, no, there we go, little guy, little guy on the perch lipless, sweet, healthy looking fish too. All right, you guys. I am going to switch it up to a weightless Senko, just a three-out hook. And the color for the Senko is going to be the smoke with black and purple. But that's not a surprise to a lot of you because some of you know that the smoke in black with purple is my favorite color Senko. Go get him.
I got one, dude. But I'm gonna lose him because it's eight pound test and he can't. Oh, I got him. He's still there. Per, almost a yeah perfect hook set too there we go on senko yes a little bit bigger yeah a little bit bigger than the last one i caught sweet Yes. Okay. Last attempt. Any fish for the day. And I guess I'm gonna try it. No. Yeah, dude, give me a sec. Do I have a minute? Yeah. All right, hold on. What? God. And he's barely like, get up here. On the file crawl. Oh yeah. Hold on a second. Here we go. Blah. Last fish of the day. Probably big, biggest fish of the day. Yeah. Well, just kidding you guys, that's actually not the last fish of the day because now we're both gonna try it. Yeah. Which way do you want to go? I'll get out of your... I'm going to go this way with the spinner bait. Okay. He casted that way with the spinner bait. I threw the vile craw back that way. Wow. Dude, he was sitting right there too because as soon as it hit the water, dude, pow. out of nowhere oh dude he chased it up oh my is that recording yeah an unexpected pike just out of nowhere look at the scar on that fish all right well anyway I got this cast and one more because I just saw something. Oh, dude, he's hitting it. I just hit... Watch out. Got it. Nice. That's... Oh, yeah, head shakes. Oh, dude, that's another fat one. Another good sized fish. Well, nothing huge, but a nice one. Oh. Did you get one? Yeah. Oh, oh yeah, pike on the jig. Dude, it just started hurting. Don't laugh at me. I'm laughing at you. I'm laughing that you're kneeled down in pain, but still wiggling your rod. 
Dude. Ow. That actually hurts really bad. Oh, oh. I got him. Oh, dude, I just had a hit too. Dude. That's a good one. Another bass, the Biospawn Vile Craw. Another nice one. Beautiful fish. I'm gonna go back to that other spot. Over there? Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna go back over there. Let me know if you hook a hog and I'll just walk across water to film it. <laughs> Got it. Oh, he had it. All right, you guys. Oh, he's got. I was just getting ready to do an outro. The SD card on the GoPro got full again and it actually turned off as I was in the middle of the fight with this fish, but let's get him back in. Well, they got a little crazy. <laughs> okay, we got to get to an outro. All right, you guys. That is going to be it. But before I go, I'm going to have Brian tell you guys how our day really went because it started off kind of and then it came together at the end. So anyway, we started out a river, did all right, caught one little smallie, fished there for 20 minutes, wasn't too hot, pretty shallow. Went to another part of the river, didn't catch anything, wasn't too hot. Came to a lake, started off kind of slow, a couple pike, a couple little bass, and then getting ready to leave. Got one more secret spot in mine, and we ended up finishing out the day catching some, some nice, nice bass. Yes, we caught some nice fish. You caught a pike there at the end. But most importantly, Brian, uh, the co-worker of mine who is also a subscriber, did you have fun today? I had a blast. Are I had we a gonna blast. Are we gonna fish again? Oh, we're gonna fish again. Okay, and by the way, you guys, if you wanna check out Brian's Instagram, it's what on Instagram? It's Michigan's Northland? Michigan's Northland. So it's Michigan's underscore Northland? Yes. Okay. So you had fun, I had fun. Brian, pound it, caught some nice fish. And we'll see you guys in the future in another video. Underneath those lilies, dude. Hot summer day with a frog.